Thank you all. Thank you, NASDAQ. Everyone, we made history. I want to start by saying how grateful I am to my two partners. I'm constantly amazed by their evolution in their own domains. And after almost 10 years working together, they're still my lifelong best friends. Thank you. Thank you, Kai. Thank you, Xiao. I also want to thank all our employees for having the faith in the mission we have and being the critical part of it. Thank you all. Thank you for being with us. Another big thanks to our valued customers, the brightest mind in our industry, and their, their recognition is our biggest motivation to go to work every day. This journey would not have been possible without all the investors. Thank you for believing us, funding us, being extremely supportive from the passenger seat and not trying to grab the wheels. <laughs> and also, I want to give my most sincere compliments to the world-class professionals who made this happen. Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley, Credit Suisse, Huatai, Deloitte, Skadden, Latham, Tongshan, Fonda, everyone, thank you for making this happen. This is amazing. <laughs> You guys are the Michael Jordan and LeBron of our times in your profession, and we love you for that. Finally, I want to thank our families for having sacrificed so much with us. Our families are here, and all of the families of the employees, thank you for being supportive and behind us. Lastly, I wanted to share our vision of why we, why we did what we did as Hasai. Our vision is to empower robotics. Technology evolution has always been about freeing people up from the tedious and sometimes dangerous jobs. Well, for the last past 40 years, most innovations have been focused on digitalization and information sharing. Well, computers, internet, mobile phones, they've all pushed the boundaries of our times in processing and sharing information. Well, but when it comes to the physical world, we're still in the Stone Age. We're in New York City. Somebody used to do elevator operating as a full-time job. How far have we gone? People still drive. People still have to cook. People have still have to do houseworks. This isn't advanced technology. Well, we made some progress. Dishwashers are good. Coffee mach machines are good. Robots can make cars. What's missing from that is those machines, they're dumb. They don't make decisions. They just execute. Why can't they make decisions? Because Today, even our best machines, they lack the fundamental understanding of the 3D world. That's where we come in. We build 3D sensors, eyes of the future robotics. I studied robotics for my PhD. When we were at school, we understand robotics challenges were not about going from A to go point B. It's about being able to not bump into things. And that simple task, that was the difficult part. Now with Hasai's effort, with years of development, we have shipped more than 100,000 LiDARs to all the robotaxis, trucks, delivery vehicles, factory automations, all of the things to make our machines slightly better. And we believe this is a major step we're taking towards the future of robotics. And with our in-house manufacturing and the semiconductor capabilities, we now see a better chance to bring those affordable, high-quality 3D eyes of the world to us one step closer. That's why we believe we wanted to do empower robotics and elevate the lives. Last, I'd like to conclude my, well, with my favorite quote. To achieve great things, two things are needed. A plan and not quite enough time. So let's go to work. Thank you, everyone.